I think it's the public is going to be more excited to watch this movie. <laughs> I was so excited yesterday. I finally see the movie and I was so excited. Of course, I was very happy that the movie has been released all over the place, all over the world. And for me, I think that Fever is going to be, you know, the big stone for a new path where all their European talents meet and work with the big star in Bollywood. And I think it's going to be very interesting because in Europe, we know, of course, the big industry that Bollywood is, but unfortunately, we don't know anything about that. We don't know, we don't know the stars, we don't know any movie, nothing coming out in our cinema, in our theaters. So I think that the, the fact that Fever, it's gonna start to, you know, to have an own life outside India. It can be a very, very, very good, uh, good life for all the actors that, you know, all the numbers of great actors you have here. And it's not gonna be just, you know, released only in your own country. So f for this reason, I'm very excited. But again, you know, I was, you're going to see, guys, you're going to be more and more excited also to watch this movie because it's amazing. Okay. What do you say, Charlie? Well, I'm very happy that the film is getting a worldwide release because this is a film which has a very universal appeal. You know, I'm, I'm very sure that anyone and uh, everyone who watches this film is going to understand the film, will relate to the film. Uh, it's not going to be an alien film for someone in Africa or Australia or you know, New Zealand. But at the same time, I am nervous. I am really nervous uh, because I don't know. I mean, I can't help uh, uh, but be nervous before every release of mine. There is anxiety. There is this whole thing whether the audience is going to really, really like our effort or they may not appreciate the effort. You get to know only on a Friday, but there is this anxiety. Yes. Okay, Christina, why did you choose Fever? What was the X factor in the movie? And uh, why? Why Fever? You know, of course, I choose movies, but I also choose movies. The, the movies choose me, and uh, that's what Rajiv did. Rajiv came uh, uh, two years ago and asked me if I if I want you know act in his movie, and uh, I think I I had a I had a great idea to say yes because uh, really it is a very special film, and uh, so of course what I, I really like on this movie is the script. The script is uh, absolutely original and unique. And, uh, and the base was already very strong. It was very, already, uh, very original. Uh, but you know, in the way he's been shot, in the way where he's was shot, and uh, the acting and, and the editing is just amazing. So I, I, yesterday, you know, when I discovered the film, I was so proud to be part of that. And uh, you know, really, thank you forever, Rajiv Javari, that you chose me. And what would you say about Rajiv? Because he is considered as a, one of the best critically acclaimed Bollywood actor. I, of course, I didn't know him before. And uh, he told me during the movie, where I was showing the movie, that you know, he, he has his idea of his career. Not career, but you know, choosing very, very specific movie. And uh, I was very impressed about all the fans. I was writing to, writing to you in, on the internet that you know, they were really expecting him in a new movie. We're expecting a new performance and that I say, wow, I get a lucky because it's not any actor. It's someone that, you know, his name is linked to quality. Mm -hmm. So any movie where you get in, it's a quality movie. And that's right. strangely exactly what I do and I'm looking for mm -hmm. in my career. I don't, you know, sometimes I did a commercial movie but uh, I, I was literally suffering during the set. And of course, when it's uh, an author movie with a quality movie, the budget, unfortunately, is not very high, but the quality pay you back. And then I think that, you know, to be in a movie with Rajiv, it's synonym of quality. So thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Rajiv, uh, you are romancing three gorgeous women in the movie, Katrina is beside you. What would you say about this? Well, I had the best time of my real, real time. <laughs> Three gorgeous women, what do you say about it? I mean, I am actually getting tired of this question because I, which I knew it right from day one that I'd be, you know, thrown this question in every interview of mine that how did you feel with these three gorgeous women? How would a man feel in the company of these three gorgeous women is my answer actually to all the men who actually think and want to know more about how, how was it, how was it? You can't even imagine it was like wonderful. <laughs> Yeah. 
हमारी इंडिया में मैं सिर्फ इतना कहना चाहूँगा कि इसमें फिल्म जो इंटीमेसी है वो एक स्टोरी टेलिंग का पार्ट है और बहुत ही कंफर्टेबली शूट किया गया बहुत ही कंफर्टेबली एग्जीक्यूट भी किया गया मतलब पहली बार शायद ऐसा था कि मैं कोई इंटरव्यू सीन कर रहा हूँ और मैं बहुत ज़्यादा उसके बारे में सोच नहीं रहा हूँ यू नो अदरवाइज़ अगर कोई हिंदी फिल्म होती यू नो मैं अब मैं बहुत सोच रहा होता आई वुड रियली थॉट अ लॉट अबाउट इट क्या हाउ डू आई डू दिस सीन बट आई थिंक द मोमेंट फॉर दिस फिल्म मे बी बिकॉज ऑफ द प्रोफेशनलिज्म इन लोगों की तरफ से बिकॉज ऑफ देयर प्रोफेशनलिज्म एंड देयर बींग मे बी यू नो नॉट थिंकिंग द वे वी थिंक अबाउट इंटीमेट सीन इट्स लाइक पार्ट ऑफ अ जॉब यू जस्ट एग्जीक्यूरेट एंड एंड स्पेशली मैंने रवैर रवेट आपको मालूम है पहले से कि मेरे स्क्रिप्ट में है और मुझे इस तरह की स्टोरी टेलिंग कहने का अंदाज़ है इनका डायरेक्टर का तो ये मेरे लिए पहली बार ऐसा था कि बस ठीक है इट वॉज जस्ट पार्ट ऑफ एनी अदर इमोशन मतलब पहली बार ये भी समझ में आया कि आया कि यार आप थप्पड़ मारते वक्त लात मारते वक्त घूसे मारते वक्त चाकू मारते वक्त इतना सोचते नहीं हो जितना किस करते वक्त सोचते हो तो आई थिंक दिस वॉज इट इट वॉज आई मीन इंटीमेसी इज़ नॉट वॉट द फिल्म इज़ अबाउट ये फिल्म में no बहुत way. कुछ याद आता है <laughs> इस फिल्म में इंटीमेसी सिर्फ एक स्टाइल ऑफ स्टोरी टेलिंग है और बहुत खूबसूरती से किया है और मेरे ख्याल से बहुत डायरेक्टली भी किया है यू नो जैसे हम लोग आधा अधूरा वाला मामला नहीं है कि हम भैया यू नो सिर्फ ऑडियंस लाने के लिए यू नो यू जस्ट ब्रिंग इन सम एलिमेंट दिस इज अ पार्ट ऑफ स्टोरी टेलिंग दिस इज हाउ इट इज एज सिंपल इज दैट फिल एक्स फिल लस एक्स फैक्टर राजीव वॉन्टीज but it's uh, it's of course it's completely different and uh, i can't say it's a very link and that's why I, otherwise is always propose the same role there's nothing to do you know my irina caro in fever is nothing to do with my solange dimitrios and that's of course is one of the reason why also i i accepted to to play in this in this movie we can always play in the same role and that's what i i'm not interested in for okay. in my career rajiv aap apni international jo viewers hai aur indian viewers hai kya expect kar rahe hain क्या मैं कर दे मेरा जवाब है हाँ सो क्या एक्सपेक्ट कर रहा हूँ इंटरनेशनल ऑडियंस से और इंडियन ऑडियंस से मैं अपनी इंडियन ऑडियंस से एक्सपेक्ट कर रहा हूँ कि उन्हें एक पहली बहुत समय के बाद मेरे को डिफरेंट फिल्म देखने को मिलेगी और वो उस फिल्म का मज़ा उठाएंगे मुझे ऐसा लगता है कि काफ़ी टाइम हो गया जब हमने कोई बहुत ही डिफरेंट किस्म की फिल्में देखी अगर हम देखें इस साल में कोई बहुत ही डिफरेंट किस्म की जिसे देखकर हमें लगे कि यार ये स्टोरी टेलिंग बहुत ही नहीं थी पहली बार ऐसा कुछ देखने को मिला है कई महीनों के बाद सालों के बाद में तो मुझे लगता है हमारी इंडियन ऑडियंस के लिए एक बहुत अच्छा सरप्राइज़ है सस्पेंस थ्रिलर आपने देखी होंगी लेकिन पहली बार आप इस तरह की सस्पेंस थ्रिलर फिल्म देखेंगे जो आप देख आपको लगेगा कि ये मैंने पहली बार देखी है मज़ा आ गया और मैं उम्मीद करता हूँ कि यू नो मैं भी बेनिफिट करूँगा उस उस चीज़ से बिकॉज आई एम वेरी हैप्पी टू बी एंड आई एम प्राउड टू बी ए पार्ट ऑफ दिस फिल्म इंटरनेशनल ऑडियंस ऑफकोर्स एक यूनिवर्सल फिल्म है इंडिया की तरफ से आ रही है एक बहुत ही यूनिवर्सल थीम है यूनिवर्सल अपील है लेट्स होप दैट वी गेट अप्रिसिएशन फ्राम ऑल क्वार्टर्स वन मोर थिंग आई वॉन्ट टू आस्क वॉट्स योर टेक ऑन दायरेसी आजकल फिल्में बहुत लीक हो रही है पायरेसी इज़ अ बिग बिग इशू अब तो थक गए हम उन लोगों को ये पका बोलते बोलते पुलिस भी थक गई है गवर्नमेंट थक गई है बोलते बोलते क्योंकि ये इशू आज का नहीं है कई सालों से है पायरेसी के चल रहे हैं धंधे चल रहे हैं बिजनेस चल रहे हैं अब सिर्फ ऑडियंस के ऊपर है डिपेंड करता है अगर आप लोग फिर भी देखते हैं तो हमारी मेहनत को अगर आप उस पर पानी फेर देना चाहते हैं तो देखिए आप ऑनलाइन देखिए आप चुरा के देखिए बट रिक्वेस्ट है आपसे कि आप हमारी मेहनत पर पानी ना फेरें Because this is a big, biggest problem in Bollywood industry. I think in Bollywood, the unfortunate is everywhere in the world. Um, I don't know what you said, but you know, um, I know some people think that we are lucky because we have uh, a quite nice life, actors. But behind the movie, there's not only actors. There's so many people that work hard, and there's so many people that you know make a movie, movie get a money back. It's the way. to keep it going working mm. if 
a movie doesn't make any profit, we can have any job in the future. Mm -hmm. Actors, especially all the crew that work hard, and their crew don't think they are lucky like actors. So there are so many people behind the movie. So it means that you cut a chain. And cutting a chain, we're going to be affected. The crew will be affected. But you, you're going to be affected, because you're not going to watch any more movie. movie. So I understand that you know, there's so many people they can't afford, but then wait till the movie is going to go in DVD. So you can buy one DVD with all your friends, so you can share that. But you know, if you're going to cut this chain, you are the first one who's going to be affected, because no one any movie will be made in future. Raj, you have a musical movies in the soundtrack, in the apart track. In future, musical movies for other quality, so do you want to do it? I don't have any plan. I don't know what I want to do tomorrow. I want to do it tomorrow. If I want to do it tomorrow, I want to do it tomorrow. I want to do it tomorrow. I want to do it tomorrow. What's your take? I don't have any take. I don't have any opinion about anything. I have no opinion on any particular subject. I keep my slate blank. जो बना रहे हैं फिल्म मैं उम्मीद करता हूँ उन्हें एक अच्छा एक्टर मिल जाए मैं उम्मीद करता हूँ कि वो जस्टिस कर पाए अपने कैरेक्टर को एंड आई होप कि जो भी फिल्म बना रहे हैं हम एंजॉय करें उस फिल्म को ओके लास्ट मैसेज टू योर ऑडियंस दे तो दिया देखिए तो घुमा फिरा के वापस सेम से अच्छा हाँ हमारी फिल्म रिलीज़ हो रही है फीवर पाँच अगस्त को और हम उम्मीद करते हैं कि आप सिनेमा हॉल में जाकर इस फिल्म को देखेंगे यू विल नॉट वॉच इट ऑनलाइन बिफोर द फिल्म रिलीज इज बिफोर इट इज़ लेजिटिमेटली ऑनलाइन और ऑन डी वी डीज इस इस कोने बी ए क्लासिक इस फिल्म दैट यू विल वॉन्ट टू कीप इट इन योर शेल्फ सो प्लीज़ गोन एंजॉय द फिल्म ऑन फिफ्थ ऑगस्ट इन थिएटर इंजॉय how much you can this movie bring your brain with you because you need it you really need to, to explore all his intimacy life and uh, you're gonna be you're gonna enjoy so much this movie because it's a great and you're gonna be really your heart is gonna beating fast and you're gonna get a fever watching this movie thank you, thank you so much for thank you so much thank you, thank you.